stand for that flag. Alrighty then, Tom's rant. Uh, this is like July 5th. Uh, the clown, uh, Stephen Corbert, never found a guy funny. Okay, this has nothing to do with Republican, Democrat, or anything else. I just never really found his humor funny. So anyway, Marjorie Taylor Greene, she's a uh, uh, senator, or congresswoman, and uh, numerous times his film crew was led into, or came into, the Capitol building and was harassing her numerous times. I mean, yeah, I'm sure it was on his, uh, you know, show. But anyway, she's been harassed, so have others, okay? So they kept getting away with it. So uh, she uh, took a 30-minute thing on um, the floor and was talking about how his film crew gets away with just roaming the halls. So, the uh, January 6th uh, trespassers, insurrectionists, uh, they're charged with illegal entry, okay, because they trespassed into, you know, Congress. So, generally, usually that's a misdemeanor. So, anyway, it's not about them. Uh, some of them people are still in jail. 16 months later, they're still in jail Okay. While Stephen Corbert's film crew roams the halls and harasses people. So finally, they did something about it. They arrested seven members of his crew, and they're supposed to char they charged them with uh, the same uh, with uh, not credible trespass, but um, you know, getting. Uh, uh, not being authorized, uh, you know, to be roaming the halls. So they said they were there to do post interviews, right? They caught them. I believe it was up on the seventh floor, which is where uh, Marjorie Taylor Greene, that's where her office is, I believe, and um, another Republican senator. So they were up there basically harassing them. So anyway, they were arrested, and it's up to the one-sided Department of Justice whether or not to charge them with unlawful entry, okay, or trespass. I'm going to make a statement right now. You have January 6th people that did the exact same thing. They've been in jail for 16 months and treated like crap. Horrible, the things they've done to those people. So now Stephen Corbert's film crew of seven, they get arrested for the exact same thing. And I'll be willing to bet there aren't going to be any charges. They're going to slap them on the wrist and say, well, you know, you guys shouldn't have been in there. Because you have to have a press ID around your neck so they can see it. And if you're there to see a senator, somebody like me goes there and I want to see the senator... You are escorted to that person's office. You cannot roam the halls nilly-nally, or whatever they say. <laughs> so anyway, I just want to say I'll be willing to bet that nothing's going to happen to his film crew because he hates Republicans. He's a Democrat. His film crew was trespassing where they had no right to be. And you watch what happens. They will not get charged the Department of Justice will just say, well, oh, you guys didn't know. Oh, they'll come up with some BS reason not to charge them. So they'll get away with it. And I never found Corbert funny at all. So anyway, I just wanted to say that real quick. Uh, this is kind of about credible. Uh, they should be charged. They should be in jail the same as the January 6th people. If you're, you've had them in jail for, for 16 months... Colbert's people should be put in the same jail under the exact same conditions, which we know won't happen. Uh, there was drug smugglers or dealers, whatever you want to call them, caught 
with 150,000 fentanyl pills. 150,000. Okay? So these, uh, you know, let's not prosecute the criminals. Let's let them out on their own reconnaissance, no bail type deal. You know how many states, California, a bunch of others are doing that. 150,000 pills, all right, doses of fentanyl. They let them go. And come to find out, there were illegals. So both of them were in this country illegally, but because of a sanctuary state or sanctuary city, they didn't bother turning them in, and the prosecutors say, well, you know, we're not going to do anything, just let them go. And they probably told them, well, you know, show up for your court date. You know they're not going to show up. So that shows you how the justice system in this country is screwed. If you're on the left, do say whatever you want. You're on the right. Ooh, see now, 16 months in jail already, and all you did was unlawfully enter a building. You didn't break in. You just walked in. Uh, so, yeah. Now, the ones who broke in, smashed glass, broke in, and did damage and stuff, absolutely they should be prosecuted. I, I'm all for that. But not just for unlawful entry. That's just nuts. And Corbera's people will get away with it. So anyway, I just wanted to make this a quick short one because I never liked the clown anyway. The guy's just, his humor is, I don't know. You know. So anyway, thanks for watching. Um, hit the little B in the bottom right hand corner if you want to subscribe. Or subscribe anyway. And it'll let you know every time I uh, upload a, uh, a video. And uh, the notification bell will let you know when I upload a video. So anyway, um, I'm up to like 47,380 views or something like that. So I appreciate everybody watching my videos. And uh, thanks. So, thanks for watching.